Hey there! Are you curious about the intersection of neuroscience and AI, and how they're transforming our world? The intersection of neuroscience and artificial intelligence AI, is an exciting and rapidly evolving area of research. Neuroscience is the study of the nervous system, including the brain and its functions, while AI is the simulation of intelligent behavior in machines. The two fields share common interests in understanding how intelligence works and how to replicate it, leading to several fascinating research questions and applications. Well, look no further because we're diving into the fascinating world of brain-computer interfaces and the incredible impact they're having on our daily lives. Welcome to Zone Tech. In this video, we are going to talk about the intersection of neuroscience and AI and how brain-computer interfaces is transforming our world. So before starting, please like this video and subscribe to our channel for future updates. Here are some key ways in which neuroscience and AI intersect. Learning and Adaptation Learning and adaptation are fundamental processes in both neuroscience and artificial intelligence AI. In neuroscience, learning involves changes in the strength of connections between neurons, known as synaptic plasticity, which allows the brain to encode new memories and adapt to new experiences. This process involves the activation of specific neural circuits that are strengthened or weakened based on their patterns of activity. Similarly, in AI, learning involves the adjustment of algorithms or models based on data inputs, allowing the system to make predictions and classifications with greater accuracy over time. This process can involve supervised, unsupervised, or reinforcement learning methods, depending on the type of data available and the desired outcome. In both fields, the ability to learn and adapt is crucial for developing intelligent systems that can respond to changing environments and achieve better performance over time. Perception and Cognition Perception and cognition are key areas of interest in both neuroscience and artificial intelligence AI. Perception involves how humans and machines sense and interpret the world around them, including the processing of sensory information such as vision, hearing, and touch. In neuroscience, perception is studied through the investigation of neural circuits that are responsible for processing different types of sensory information, such as the visual cortex in the brain. In AI, perception involves the development of algorithms that can interpret and recognize patterns in data, such as an image or speech recognition systems. Cognition, on the other hand, refers to the higher-level processes of thinking, reasoning, and decision-making. In neuroscience, cognition is studied through the investigation of cognitive processes such as attention, memory, and language. In AI, cognition involves the development of algorithms and models that can reason and make decisions based on complex data inputs. Both perception and cognition are important for developing intelligent systems that can interact with and make sense of the world around them. Brain-Inspired Computing Brain-inspired computing is a field of research that seeks to develop computing systems and algorithms that are inspired by the structure and function of the human brain. The goal of this approach is to create more efficient and powerful computing systems that can perform complex tasks with greater accuracy and speed. One example of brain-inspired computing is deep learning, which is a type of machine learning algorithm that uses artificial neural networks with multiple layers, inspired by the layered structure of neural networks in the brain. Another example is neuromorphic computing which aims to mimic the parallel processing and energy efficiency of the brain by using analog circuits that simulate the behavior of neurons and synapses. Brain-inspired computing is a rapidly evolving field with many potential applications, including image and speech recognition, autonomous vehicles, and robotics. Brain-Computer Interfaces Brain-Computer Interfaces BCIs are systems that allow direct communication between the brain and a computer or other electronic device. BCIs can enable people with disabilities to control prosthetic limbs, communicate through a computer, or interact with the environment using their thoughts. BCIs work by detecting and interpreting patterns of neural activity in the brain, typically using non-invasive techniques such as electroencephalography (EEG) or functional magnetic resonance imaging (fMRI). Invasive techniques, such as implantable electrodes, are also used in some cases. The development of BCIs requires an understanding of both the brain and AI technologies, as the interpretation of neural signals often involves the use of machine learning algorithms. 
BCIs have the potential to transform the lives of people with disabilities and could also have applications in areas such as gaming, education, and entertainment. However, the development of BCIs also raises ethical concerns, such as privacy and data protection, which need to be addressed as technology advances. Ethical Considerations The intersection of neuroscience and artificial intelligence AI, raises important ethical considerations that need to be addressed as technology advances. One major concern is privacy and data protection, particularly in the context of brain-computer interfaces BCIs which can access sensitive personal information such as thoughts, emotions, and intentions. There is a need to develop robust ethical guidelines and regulations to ensure that BCIs are used safely and responsibly and that personal data is protected from unauthorized access or misuse. Another concern is the potential for misuse of AI technologies, such as the use of facial recognition or other biometric technologies for surveillance or discrimination. Researchers in both neuroscience and AI need to be aware of these risks and work towards developing responsible and safe applications. Additionally, there are also concerns about the potential for AI to replace human jobs, exacerbate inequality, and perpetuate bias and discrimination. Addressing these ethical considerations will require collaboration between researchers, policymakers, and the public to ensure that the benefits of these technologies are realized while minimizing their potential harms. How Brain-Computer Interfaces Are Transforming Our World? Brain-Computer Interfaces BCIs, are transforming our world by enabling people to interact with technology in new and innovative ways. One major application of BCIs is in the field of assistive technology, where they are being used to help people with disabilities to communicate, control prosthetic limbs, or access the environment using their thoughts. For example, BCIs have been used to help people with paralysis control robotic arms, allowing them to perform everyday tasks such as feeding themselves or grasping objects. BCIs are also being used to help people with speech impairments to communicate by translating their thoughts into speech or text. BCIs also have potential applications in other areas such as gaming, entertainment, and education. In education, BCIs could be used to provide personalized learning experiences by tracking the student's attention and adjusting the content to their individual needs. Using BCIs for gaming is one thing, but using them for collaborative gaming? Yep, that's possible too. Arguably more a brain-computer brain interface than a brain-computer one. Recent research published by the University of Washington allowed three people to play a Tetris-type game by networking their brains. The game was the culmination of years of work on machine learning to decode someone's intended movements from an EEG. There was a question that came up, which was if the signal that you extract is being sent to a robotic device or cursor on a screen. What if you could send that signal directly to a person's brain? Says Reg H. Rao, professor at the University of Washington's Paul G. Allen School of Computer Science and Engineering and a co-director of the University's Center for Neurotechnology. However, the development of BCIs also raises important ethical considerations, such as privacy and data protection, as well as concerns about the potential for misuse and discrimination. Addressing these ethical considerations will be crucial for ensuring that the benefits of BCIs are realized while minimizing their potential harms. Overall, BCIs are transforming our world by opening up new possibilities for human-computer interaction and providing a pathway toward more personalized and accessible technology. With continued research and development, BCIs have the potential to revolutionize how we interact with technology and improve the lives of people with disabilities and other impairments. So that's it for today. What do you think of our video? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video and would like to hear more from us, please subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications before you go. Thank you for watching.